Happy Friday, y'all. I hope everyone had a terrific week. It is almost Thanksgiving. I'm going to celebrate tomorrow, though. But I think me and Sadie might have some turkey again on the actual Thanksgiving. All right, so um, I was working on this wolf, and I do need to do some more and see if I can salvage this one. And so this is my progress. I did this one this week, and I, I think he turned out okay. It's just that I love this one. This one, there is just something about it that just snaps out. And I am going to, I think, go ahead now and just do a howling wolf so that I can have two images make prints of the two because a lot of times people buy things in duplicate. So I'm gonna buy, uh, buy, get the, the prints done of this one because he's gonna have to get scanned in. My scanner isn't big enough to get a high res a high resolution image of this one. So I will take him off when I get the, uh, the other one done and take him at the same time to get scanned. And then I can do a whole bunch of prints. So I'm gonna cut out and Sadie is already over there at the studio. So I'll, let's look at a couple of the paintings I've been working on. So I will see you all in a sec. Heading on over to the studio, and there she goes, ready to hit her mark. Yay, Sadie. Say hello. Nope, she's just gonna pose. You gonna be a model today? All right, so let's see what's going on here. As you can see, I did push everything back a bit this week with, um, a little bit with this easel here and this one's back so I have more space to actually work because I had another easel that was behind I'm off here and it was getting just a little crowded and I wasn't working on the one behind there and it's really hard to work on that easel anyway because it's really more for posting things like posters so anyway oak tree um, I was hoping to get to that one and I didn't this week. So this one, whoop, let me come back a little bit. Uh, did do more of putting in the black on this one. So again, all of this, this light or green color is, so, yeah, what's that? It, well, I mean, that's what we're doing. Did you just give me a kick? I was working on it. You were sitting right there too when I did it. I mean, you were. You watched me. All right. So some of that green is might shine through just a little bit with the black area, but the more I cover those up, the more you're going to see the definitions of the pansies. Well, yes. And I'm going to play with you in a minute. All right. So this one here. And I'm going to walk over to this side a little bit so you can see. We got a little bit of a shadow over here. Let me see if I can adjust that a little bit. Um, yeah, we're still getting a little bit coming in here from the chair. So I'm going to pull this out. We can get a better look here. There we go. All right. So. If you look closely, there are three separate canvases here. I clipped them in the back together so I can paint it all as one. And now what you're looking at, I'm going to go in and finish up this green and then a little bit lighter back here. Maybe there's another field. Maybe it's uh, just farther in the background. These could be either mountains or they could be clouds. So you've got some of the the sky effect there with some of the pink and now it's not going to stay that bright because this is abstract but now it's looking like whoa wow right, it's not going to stay that bright on the background because it's going to look a little bit more like that once i 
start covering up the background a bit. So this is the first horse. Again, these are gonna be three horses, what I call my Trinity Spirit horses, with faith, hope, and grace. And there they are down here. There's faith right over here, hope, and grace. So those will be on the front like this. So done in some indigo and then some other colors to bring that out. And then I'll come over once I have the background in more of a, a, a um, not really taupe. I have more of a, it'll have a sort of a yellowish tint to it. And then I'll highlight some of these. So hopefully some of this will come through and we will be working on this. I'm trying to get as much of this one done as possible because part of my project for my art class is using emotion. And this piece and this piece, as well as the wolf, were done from very emotional perspectives. So, a lot of fun. And Sadie has left. I'm going to zoom in here. You can see that she is more interested in eating than talking. So we will see you all next time.